Too dangerous. Sorry. Blow yourself up. Blow your neighbor up. Blow the whole town up. Huh. Alright, so yep. that's not gonna work. So those two failed because I don't have enough uh, bartering skills or knowledge in explosive at the moment. So let's just go back and talk to this fellow over here. At least we were able to get Trudy and Sunny on our side. And that should be enough though. I don't think we're gonna need uh, the dynamite or the extra armor slash weapons. Uh, where are you, buddy? Sleeping, eh? Wake up. So what's going on? Did Sunny agree to help us? Well, I guess that means we're ready to go. Unless you think there's something else you can do. All right, I'm ready. I hope. Time to look alive. The Powder Gangers are here to play. At least six. Joe Cobb included. They look pretty mean. I'll be set up near the store. Let's hope that the gang doesn't manage to make it that far. Alright, let's do this. Get some action up in here. We probably loot their bodies and get some weapons as well. Uh, you established a reputation with a group of people in the wasteland. Whether the reputation is good or bad, you finally, you're finally somebody. And people associated with that group will start to react to what you've done. There are many different functions in the wasteland, or factions, in the wasteland that you can develop a distinct reputation with each one. As you perform actions that benefit a group, you will gain fame. If you perform actions that harm a group, you will gain infamy. Your reputation with any given group is a measure of the combined total of fame and infamy that you have earned. The benefits and drawbacks of a given reputation depends on the group itself. You may receive discounts with merchants, provoke attacks from hired thugs, or simply be treated differently. Though you will initially start out with a neutral reputation, reputation with any given faction, your fame and infamy will eventually push your reputation to different directions. You can see all your current reputations under the general section of your pit boy. All right. So light. We're shunned by the powder gangers. I owe you a huge favor for this. Here, these are technically Crimson Caravan funds, but I know they'll understand once I explain things. I'll stick around for a bit longer, but I'll be gone in a few days. If you ever visit New Vegas, look me up at the Crimson Caravan camp. Alright, Crimson Caravan at New Vegas. Oh, revolver. down over here right 
Yeah. And let's see, we have two of these, right? Which one's the higher condition one? That one has seven damage. This one has, ah, oh, they're the same, all right. Uh, let's see. Sturdy caravan shotgun. Single shotgun. Mod? No mods. Can we repair this? No. So I think we're done there. Hello. Where's Sunny? She has to be around here somewhere. Oh, you two doing something back here? That'll teach the powder gangs to avoid good springs in the future. Until next time. Whoa. Oh, okay. Um. Do I want to do that? I don't think so. Yeah, I'm not going to take those. We are not going to touch any of that stuff because I don't want to get a negative reputation Hello? after I help them. Alright, let's go ahead. Get out of here. I'm not too sure where to go now. I think we're gonna move on to Prim. We can pull out a map, can we? Uh, world map. So, what do we have here? Good Springs, we're like there. And... Yeah, I think we're gonna go on to Prim because that's uh, what everyone was talking about. So we have our waypoint set over there. Is there anyone else we should talk to before we move on? We could always come back and uh, have another discussion later on, but I don't think we'll be coming back to this town in the near future. I suppose we could go ahead and see if Trudy has anything new to say, if I could find her. I'm glad that business is over. I like it when Good Springs is nice and quiet. Got a special discount for you after what you've done for us. Hooray. All right, so what can we sell? Um, apparel. Let's see. Lightweight metal armor, minus one agility. You get rid of that. Uh, armor Vault 13. Get rid of that. Raiding armor. Let's get rid of that as well. We'll keep this one for now. So let's go ahead and accept that. Um, I don't think these... Most of these shouldn't have weight. Doctor's bag. Restore all body parts. Okay, that's good, so we'll keep those. Miscellaneous cases. Has no weight anyways. Carton of cigarettes. Let's sell that. What? No more caps? Oh, 
shoot, that means I gave stuff away for free. Darn it. Alright, can we buy anything then? Squirrel on a stick. Why would I ever want that? Atomic cocktail? No. Nope. I was hoping you had a... Uh, oh, eight. There we go. No, nothing? Alright, well, let's go Give ahead and exit shot if then. You need anything else. Be careful out there. So I think we'll go ahead and make our way to Prim. There's nothing else here for us, I think. So let's see. Let's get our bearings straight and we're gonna go straight down to Prim. Should I be exploring the other uh, areas in this town? Maybe, but for now, we're just gonna get out of here. Um, I don't need an empty bottle. Why am I looking at empty bottles? So hopefully we don't run into uh, too much trouble on our way there. I wonder how long this is going to take. Hopefully I'm not forgetting anything back uh, a good spring. There's probably something critical I'm missing, but uh, you know what? If there's something we're missing, we could always go back and uh, check it out later on. Uh, seems like there's a baddie coming up. Nope, disappeared. Maybe we should have talked to the doctor. Uh, before you venture deeper into a wasteland, you may revise your character. Alright, so we could rebuild character. What's that? Okay. So we could change the hair and things like that if we want. But uh, we're going to keep it as is. Yes, we're going to keep that. I thought I clicked yes. Uh, we could redo the attributes. Do I want to redo these though? Go ahead with that. Why not? Yeah, I'm, I'm fine with that. Uh, do I want to do traits? We could do uh, heavy handed. I doubt we'll use uh, much melee anyways, so maybe we'll just go with that trait.
whatever, we'll go with Kamikaze. Minus two thresh damage threshold. That's not that's not uh, that bad. So I think we'll go with that. Done. And I think uh, we're good. I'm not sure if that was a good choice or not, but uh, that's what we're going with. Barter. Uh, let's see. Let's jump these back up. And let's pump that up and let's bring repair up a little as well. And then we decide to go with the intense training. And let's bring endurance up to five. Actually, perception. Should we bring perception up? I think we're going to increase perception. There we go. I think I think that's good. We have some baddies down here. Oh, more of these uh guys, eh? Did I miss twice, seriously? You stuck. Killing them geckos. What's this plant? Sure, we'll take some of that. Maybe we can make something later on. I have no clue uh, what we can make with these, but uh, taking it anyways. There. I'm not gonna bother with that though. Are you coming up? That's gotta hurt. Roach meat. Delicious. If I could kill a couple more things, I could probably level up. Should we just kill a couple more things? Can I actually change my weapon? Uh, let's grab a... You know what? Let's use a machete. Ah! Okay. Can I use bats with this? That works. Any more? So we're at Prim, there's a roller coaster right over there. But I'm looking for a couple more baddies that I could kill in order to level up. There's another bot fly, it looks like. So we're gonna go ahead and hunt that down. Get over here, little guy. I got business with you. Where are you at? Come on. Stop running. Alright, actually this might take a little bit longer than I expected, so I think I'm just gonna go ahead. Oh, here's a little gecko. Or, uh, yeah, gecko.
All right, whatever. Let's let's just go to Prim. This is gonna take a lot longer than I originally anticipated. You discovered, you have discovered several locations. You can fast travel back to discover locations using the world map and your pet boy. That's good to know. So let's see, how do we get in here? Hey, where the hell do you think you're going? Prim is off limits. Some convicts from the prison up the road have taken over the town. Everyone inside is either dead or in hiding. What's more, there are two tribes of raiders causing trouble in this area as well. You'd be safer heading back up to Good Springs. Be careful. You may want to talk to Lieutenant Hayes. He's in a tent down the road. Just stay on the west side of the overpass if you don't want to get shot. West side of the war pass, all right. So I'm assuming this is uh, the path I need to take. Maybe I should save it just in case. So we gotta talk to a lieutenant or lieutenant. Depends uh where you're from if you want to pronounce it one way or the other. You lost? No, I'm not lost. But thanks for asking, how considerate. Mines. Don't wanna step on those. I don't wanna blow myself up. Alright, so we gotta look for the uh, lieutenant. I'm sure he is around here somewhere. Sergeant, I'm Sergeant McGee of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Company. If you want to talk about something, speak to Lieutenant Hayes. I'm from Hub originally, but it's been a long time since I saw it. I'm on my second tour here. Most non-commissioned officers are. Sir. Hello? I'm Lieutenant Hayes of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Company. What's your business? We were sent out here to hold back the tide of convicts from the correctional facility. As you can probably tell, we aren't doing the kind of job we could be doing. Most people just call it NCRCF. That's NCR Correctional Facility. A little bit ago, the convicts there staged a coup. Killed the guards that weren't able to escape. And have been ransacking the area since then. The mission isn't a problem. The problem is with supplies. Convicts are better armed and organized than our intel initially suggested. I'm trying to get some reinforcements here, maybe some guns with some firepower, but shit. Things are just going slow. Not much. They've taken to calling themselves powder gangers, mostly because they've taken to using the explosives meant to clear boulders as weapons. They got organized faster than I would have thought, most of them at least. Thankfully, the small group in town here seemed to have split off from the main force, so they aren't getting anything in the way of support. I have some free time. Ask away. Sir? Hello? It's been a long tour. All I can think about now is going back home. Alright, so wh why did we talk to Lieutenant Hayes? Yeah. We were sent out here to... Goodbye. What is it? Sir.
question is, can we sneak in to that area so we can explore it? sure if I want to cross that bridge yet. Let's take a look at our map and see uh, where to go from there. Confused. I thought we had to talk to the guy over there, but he didn't really say anything. What is it? And McGee's Sir. not saying anything either, so I'm not too sure where to go on from here. I'm sure I'm just missing something very obvious, but can't quite put my finger on it. Let's go ahead and talk to him once again and see if he has anything to say. Yeah. Where's Most hmm. Nope, nothing. Goodbye. Nothing as of yet, so I'm not too sure. I think we're gonna go ahead and head back and see uh if we could explore the other surrounding areas, maybe go to, oh, oh, that would be, yeah, maybe go, maybe we'll go to Canyon Records and see uh, what that is before we move on to uh, another location. But uh, this is it for now, so I just want to say thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed, and of course, until next time, I'll see you guys later.